Michael Negrete, Disappearance, 1999. Michael Negrete, or Negrete, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, was born on the 25th of March, 1981. Michael was a freshman at UCLA in California when he went missing on the 10th of December, 1999. He lived on the sixth floor of Dykstra Hall Dormitory on campus, which is located near the intersection of Gailey Avenue and Strathmore Boulevard. On the day he went missing, Michael, or Mike, as his friends knew him, attended a party with his friends on the floor he lived on, then returned later to his room. He then played an online computer game with a friend in another room. At 4am he finished the game and went to his friend's room to congratulate the other player. He was last seen by this friend returning to his room. Mike and the Greek was never seen again. Mike's roommate I woke at 9am and noticed Mike was gone, but his clothing, shoes, wallet, keys and musical instruments were all still there. Authorities believe he left his room between 4am and 9am that day. Search dogs tracked Mike's scent to Sunset Boulevard and Bellagio Street in Los Angeles, but no other evidence was located. There are possible key witnesses who may have seen someone matching Michael's description leaving the building at 4.35 a.m. but this was never substantiated however. Authorities released a sketch of a possible witness in the Negretti's case in the year 2000. The unidentified man who was described as Caucasian was seen inside Dykstra Hall at 4.35 a.m. on December 10. Investigators do not know if this person is connected to Michael's case or if he did indeed witness anything but they would like to question him however. The man was around mid-thirties, an average height with a large build. He was wearing a grey jacket. Mike didn't own a car at the time of his disappearance and the LAPD bloodhounds traced his scent to a bus stop across from the campus. However, investigators subsequently said that the dogs were confused and the scent could not be trusted. The police searched all over campus looking for Mike, including the garbage chutes and construction sites, but nothing, nothing ever came of that. More than 500 leads were submitted to police, but nothing came from any of them either. Michael left behind his parents and two younger brothers. He loved playing video games and was a skilled trumpet and steel drum player. He was in college on a music scholarship at the time of his disappearance. There has been no activity on any of his credit cards. LAPD consider his disappearance to be suspicious and have categorised his disappearance as a homicide case. Sadly. No trace of Michael Negrete has been found to this day.